Data exchange formats for ambisonics have undergone radical changes since the early days of four-track magnetic tape. Researchers working on very high-order systems found no straightforward way to extend the traditional formats to suit their needs. Furthermore, there was no widely accepted formulation of spherical harmonics for acoustics, so one was borrowed from chemistry, quantum mechanics, computer graphics, or other fields, each of which had subtly different conventions. This led to an unfortunate proliferation of mutually incompatible ad hoc formats and much head scratching. This page attempts to document the different existing formats, their rationales and history, for the terminally curious and those unfortunate enough to have to deal with them in detail. Topic spherical harmonics in ambisonics A common formulation for spherical harmonics in the context of ambisonics is ym theta, phi equals n, m, p, m, sin phi sin minus m theta if m0, cos m theta if m0. Display style y underscore l carrot m theta phi equals n underscore l carrot m p underscore l carrot m sin phi c d o t begin cases sin m theta and m box if m where y display style y denotes a spherical harmonic of degree display style l and index m display style m with a range of minus m plus display style l l e q m l e q plus l. Note that if m equals zero display style m equals zero, then cos m theta equals cos zero equals one display style cos m theta equals cos 0 equals 1 n display style n is a normalization factor see below and pm display style p underscore l caret m is the associated legendre polynomial of degree display style l and order m display style m the azimuth angle theta display style theta is zero straight ahead and increases counterclockwise the elevation angle phi display style phi is zero on the horizontal plane and positive in the upper hemisphere Unfortunately, the ambisonic order display style L is called the degree in mathematical parlance, which uses order for the ambisonic index m display style m. Topic: Relationship of spherical harmonics and B format signals. For a source signal s display style s in direction theta phi display style theta phi the ambisonic components b m display style b underscore l caret m are given by b m equals y m theta phi s Display style b underscore l caret m equals y underscore l caret m theta phi c d o t s. If we span a direction vector from the origin towards the source until it intersects the respective spherical harmonic, the length of this vector is the coefficient that gets multiplied with the source signal. Repeat for all spherical harmonics up to the desired ambisonic order. Topic: Prerequisites for successful data exchange. For successful exchange of ambisonic material, some software requires the sender and receiver have to agree on the ordering of the components, their normalization or weighting, and the relative polarity of the harmonics. Since it is possible to omit parts of the spherical harmonic multipole expansion for content that has non-uniform, direction-dependent resolution, known as mixed order, it might also be necessary to define how to deal with missing components. In the case of transmission, by wire be it an actual digital multi-channel link or any number of virtual patch cords within an audio processing engine, these properties must be explicitly matched on both ends, since there is usually no provision for metadata exchange and parameter negotiation. In the case of files, some flexibility might be possible, depending on the file format and the expressiveness of its metadata set. However, in practice, just two formats are in widespread use. The first is FERS Malum Higher Order Format, which is an extension of traditional B format, and the more modern SN3D, in ACN channel order. In neither case is there any ambiguity about ordering, normalization, weighting or polarity and it is rare to see cases with missing components. A third format is in limited use, N3D, also in ACN channel order. Topic component ordering the traditional B format WXYZ display style WXYZ only concerned itself with zeroth and first ambisonic order. 
because of a strong correspondence between the spherical harmonics and microphone polar patterns, and the fact that those polar patterns have clearly defined directions, it seemed natural to order and name the components in the same way as the axes of a right-hand coordinate system. For higher orders, this precedent becomes awkward, because spherical harmonics are most intuitively arranged in symmetric fashion around the single Z rotationally symmetric member M equals zero of each order, with the horizontal sign terms M M greater than zero to the right see illustration. Fers Malum In Fers Malum higher order format, an extension of traditional B format up to third order, orders to R S T U V display style R S T U V and three K L M N O P Q display style K L M N O P Q begin with their Z rotationally symmetric member and then jump outward right and left C table with the horizontal components at the end. Topic. Sid. In his seminal 2001 thesis, Daniel used a three-index nomenclature Y M N Sigma Displaystyle Y underscore Minnesota carrot Sigma for the spherical harmonics, which corresponds to Y M S G N M Display style y underscore l m caret s g n m. In the notation used here, he implied yet another channel ordering, subsequently developed into an explicit proposal called SID for single index designation, which was adopted by a number of researchers. This scheme is compatible with first order B format and continues to traverse the higher spherical harmonics in the same fashion, with the z rotationally symmetric component at the end, going through the horizontal components first. This makes Daniel's ordering incompatible to Fers Malum. SID ordering is not in widespread use. Topic <laughs> ACN. For future higher order systems, adoption of the ambisonic channel number ACN has reached wide consensus. It is determined algorithmically as A C N equals Two plus plus m display style ACN equals l caret two plus l plus m. ACN is used widely with SN3D and N3D below. Topic normalization. For successful reconstruction of the sound field, it is important to agree on a normalization method for the spherical harmonic components. The following approaches are common. Topic: <laughs> Maxon. The Maxon scheme normalizes each single component to never exceed a gain of 1.0 for a pan monophonic source. Malum states that W Hilst this approach is not rigorously correct. In mathematical terms, it has significant engineering advantages in that it restricts the maximum levels a pan mono source will generate in some of the higher order channels. This property is particularly interesting for fixed point digital interfaces. Maxon is used in the Fers Malum format with the exception of a minus 3 decibels correction factor for W display style W, which makes it directly compatible with traditional B format. Otherwise, it is not in widespread use. Topic SN3D SN3D stands for Schmidt semi normalization and is commonly used in geology and magnetics. The weighting coefficients are n, m SN3D equals 2 minus delta m minus m plus m delta m 1 if m equals 0, 0 if m does not equal 0 display style n underscore l m caret text SN3D equals sqrt 2 delta underscore m l m over L plus M delta underscore M begin cases one and M box if M equals zero zero and M box if M n eq zero end cases. Originally introduced into ambisonic use by Daniel, he notes 
High degree of generality, the encoding coefficients are recursively computable, and the first order components are unity vectors in their respective directions of incidence. With SN3D, unlike N3D, no component will ever exceed the peak value of the zeroth order component for single point sources. This scheme has been adopted by the proposed AMBIX format. SN3D in the ACN channel order is in widespread use and a common choice in new software development. In the AMBIX specification paper, the 2 minus delta m is divided by 4 pi. Topic N3D. N3D or full 3D normalization is the most obvious approach to normalization. Daniel describes it as follows. Orthonormal basis for 3D decomposition. Simple relationship to SN3D. Ensures equal power of the encoded components in the case of a perfectly diffuse 3D field. Obvious significance for solving decoding problems, 3D reconstruction. The relation to SN3D is N M N three D equals N M S N three D two plus one display style N underscore L M carrot text N three D equals N underscore L M carrot text S N three D S Q R T two L plus one. This normalization is standard in physics and mathematics and is supported by some ambisonic software packages. It is used in MPEG H. However, SN3D is now much more common. As N3D and SN3D differ only by scaling factors, care is needed when working with both, as it may not be obvious on first listening if an error has been made, particularly on a system with a small number of speakers. N2D, SN2D Additionally, two schemes exist which consider only the horizontal components. This has practical advantages for fixed point media in the common situation where sources are concentrated on the horizontal plane, but the normalization is somewhat arbitrary and its assumptions do not hold for strongly diffuse sound fields and sound scenes with strong elevated sources. Since ambisonics is meant to be isotropic and the 2D schemes definitely are not, their use is discouraged. Topic. Polarity. A third complication arises from the quantum mechanical formulation of spherical harmonics, which was adopted by some ambisonics researchers. It includes a factor of minus one m display style minus one caret m, a convention called Condon Shortley phase, which will invert the relative polarity of every other component within a given ambisonic order. The term can be folded both into the formulation of the associated Legendre polynomials or the normalization coefficient, so it may not always be obvious. MATLAB and New Octave both include Condon shortly phase in its Legendre display style L X functions, but undo it by applying the factor again in the Schmidt semi-normalized form Legendre display style L X school Wolfram language also includes CS phase in its Legendre display style l x implementation and retains it in spherical harmonicity m theta phi display style l m theta phi which is fully normalized note that this function returns complex values and uses the physics convention for spherical coordinates where theta display style theta is the zenith angle angle from the positive z axis and phi Display style phi is the azimuth counterclockwise angle around the positive z axis. The presence of Condon shortly phase in parts of the signal chain usually manifests itself in erratic panning behavior and increasing apparent source width when going to higher orders, which can be somewhat difficult to diagnose and much harder to eliminate. Hence, its use is strongly discouraged in the context of ambisonics. None of the ambisonic exchange formats described above use Condon shortly phase. Polarity is generally only a concern when trying to reconcile theoretical formulations of the spherical harmonics from other academic disciplines. Reference table of layouts and normalizations 
The following table gives an overview of all ambisonic formats published so far. For Fers Malum and traditional B format, sort by Fumer column and multiply the spherical harmonic by the Maxon asterisk factor. For SID according to Daniel, sort by SID and apply the relevant normalization factor as specified in the file metadata. For basic ambics, sort by ACN and use the SN3D factor. For extended ambics and all other combinations, good luck, conversion factors can be applied either to the ambisonic components B B or the spherical harmonics Y display style Y The data is taken from Chapman 2008 please do not rely on this table until it has been thoroughly checked and the under construction notice has been removed However please note that only the FERS Malum and SN3D ACN encodings are in wide use Traditional B format is a subset of FERS Malum for both of these encodings the equations can be expressed directly without separate normalization or conversion factors and there is no ambiguity around ordering Topic <laughs> <laughs> file formats and metadata For file-based storage and transmission, additional properties need to be defined, such as the base file format and, if desired, accompanying metadata. <laughs> AMB The .amp file format was proposed and defined by Richard Dobson in 2001, based on Microsoft's WAVE underscore format underscore extensible amendment to the WAV audio file format. It mandates the use of FERS Malum encoding. From its parent, it inherits a maximum file size of 4 GB, which is a serious limitation for live recording in higher orders. .amp files are distinguished from other multi-channel content by their suffix and by setting the file subtype globally unique identifier in their header data to either of the following values. Subtype underscore AMB ISO NIC underscore B underscore format underscore PCM 0000001 0721 11 D3864 C8C1 CA0000 for integer samples, or Subtype underscore AMB ISO NIC underscore B underscore format underscore I triple E underscore float 0000003 0721 11 D3864 C8C1 CA0000 for floating point. The definition mandates that the wave underscore X dwells channel mask must be set to zero. Furthermore, it recommends that the file should contain a peak chunk, containing the value and position of the highest sample in each channel. The channels within an .amp file are interleaved, and any unused channels are omitted. This makes it possible to identify traditional hashtag H hashtag P mixed order content by the number of channels present, as per the following table. The free and open source C library Libsyn file has included .amp support since 2007. Dobson's format has been instrumental in making native ambisonic content easily accessible to enthusiasts, and to pave the way for research and deployment of higher order ambisonics. While it cannot scale any further than third order and does not accommodate hashtag H hashtag V mixed order sets, its capabilities are more than sufficient for most ambisonic content in existence today, and backwards compatibility to .amp is an important feature of any real-world ambisonic workflow. <laughs> Ambics Ambics adopts Apple's core audio format or .caf. It scales to arbitrarily high orders and has no practically relevant limitation of file size. Ambix files contain linear PCM data with word lengths of 16, 24, or 32-bit fixed point, or 32-bit float, at any sample rate valid for .caf. It uses ACN channel ordering with SN3D normalization. The basic format of Ambix mandates a complete full sphere signal set, the order of which can be uniquely and trivially deduced from the number of channels. Only the minimum header information required by the .caf specification are present and no other metadata is included. The extended format is marked by the presence of a user-defined chunk with the UUID 1AD318C300E5-5576 B2DODCA2460BC89 The original specifications used 49454D2E41542F4144D4952F5882F5 5842 5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5842F5
This matrix provides a generic way of mapping payloads in any previous format and any mix of orders to canonical periphery, ACN ordering and SN3D normalization. Theoretically, it can even accommodate sound fields that span only subsets of the sphere. AMBIX was originally proposed at the Ambisonic Symposium 2011, building upon previous work by Travis and Chapman et al. <laughs> Notes <laughs>